Hello today, and today we're going to have a game of Reckless Rufus, this time for the Amstrad CPC. I played it on the Commodore 64, it was sort of learning the game actually, and when I got to learn it, I found it a little bit frustrating, but it was okay, maybe I would have played it, but I want to see how it plays on the Amstrad CPC. It came out in 92, very late for the 8 bits. Um, 92, I had a Commodore 64 moving on to the Commodore Amiga at that time. Yes, I know, I was late to the party on both occasions, but I was there at the party for the Amstrad CPC. Or a year late. Um, but yeah, I want to see how it plays on the Amstrad CPC. Right, push fire to start. Right, start from level code. Right, so what we got to do, you see there's a three there, so that means we can move three spaces. Right, one, two, three. It's a little bit slow on the CPC. Um, so now we go on the two, I can move two spaces. Right, and you can only fire in the direction you're going, and I fucked up. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Yes, I have fucked up, because there's no, no number showing now. So, I'm going to have to kill myself. Because if you try doing that, you fall down. Right, then you have to restart the level all over again. But luckily, I played this on the Commodore 64 and worked it out for myself. I have to say, this does play better on the Commodore 64. It's a lot smoother. But it's definitely a lot more colourful on the CPC. Right, I'll move one space. So I'm going to move this over here. So now I can move three spaces. But we'll activate that. It's a little bit of a platform. So now I can move one, two, three. And that gives me that diamond. So we've got to collect all the diamonds to advance to the next level. So that means now I can move five spaces. And look, it even counts down on the CPC version. Ooh. Right, so now I can move one space down. Yeah, it's no way. It's very slow on the CPC. I mean, it's playable, but it's better on the Commodore 64, in my opinion. So, we got off that one pretty easy. Now it's going to get a little bit harder. Right, so straight away, I, I can move two spaces. Right, so we're going to go one, two. So, move three spaces, two spaces down. Right. Right. I forgot to tell you, if you go on them two first, you probably think you could, I could have gone down first, but no, they disappear. Well, I did on the Commodore 64 version. Right, what's this bit? Right, this should be auto, I guess, but I never got this far on the Commodore 64 version. As I said, I was trying to work out how to play the game. Then I realised... Because there's no instruct I don't Oh fuck. Let's just see. Yeah, they do disappear. So once you get that, you're fucked. You can't jump. It's pretty logical once you get the hang of it, but it's quite frustrating because you've got all those other things trying to stop you. Alright, so I can move two squares down. Watch these things to say I fucking kill you. And I fucked up. Yeah, that's the frustration about this game, is those other things that get in your get in your way. And I don't know if it's a set pattern. I don't think they were on the Commodore 64 version, it's a random pattern. So I can move three spaces. Ah oh, see what I mean! Oh I've got it, I've got it, I've got okay. Right, I messed up though. I have messed up. Right, that puts me back there. If I can go one there. Now, where is that going to take me? I can't fire. Right, is that going to take me down there? No, I can't. Oh, right, it's going to send me. Now, can I get out of this? I think I'm screwed. I think I'm screwed. Because it's just going to send me to the middle. And I can't get out. I can't get out of here. We can fire, but it's just 
what I'm supposed to do is go to the bottom section of the and if I want to fucking lose a life how do I do it I'll just wait hopefully that thing will hit me yeah so if you mess up you either got to lose a life or yeah lose a life right now ah did I take the code no I could have took the code didn't oh right three spaces so move three spaces down Space that would be this way. You really got to work out your route. You really got to work out your route and avoid everything if you can. Right, one, two, three. Right, get the diamond because that's what you've got to do is get all the diamonds. Yeah, with the TPC version of us, I said it. Oh, fuck! Oh, well, go away with that. But I wasted that. Now I'm fucked because now there's no way I can get that. Because that thing just got in my way. And it's going to fall down the hole. Yeah, you really got to work out what way you need to be going. And that just really... Just, oh, I got away. No, I didn't. Oh! Phone's been going off all day. Really should turn my fucking thing off. Right, okay. Go that way. All right. Go on that, that'll activate a little stone over there. No, I'm... Right, I still can go one. Right, okay. Right, so... Five. Right, so we can move one space down. Ah, fire! Did I fire? I pushed... Oh, I got away with it. I'm pushing fire, why ain't it responding? Right, so this should be the last one. Done. Right, now. Right, so we can move two spaces this way, so we've got to make sure. I messed it up. I messed it up. Oh, damn it, because what way I was, should have gone. Hang on a minute. Hang on, I messed it up. Hang on a minute. What way is that arrow going to point me? No. Can I... I'll wait till that arrow see what... I think it's just going to throw me. Ah! But there's a diamond... Oh, what happened there? Right. So... God, there's a... Bit of slowdown going on here. And I think I've fucked this up already, maybe. No, I what I'm supposed to do, I know what I'm supposed to do. Right. Right. There we go. So there's the three spaces. One, two, and down. Oh, fuck's sake! Yeah, that's annoying. Right, so now I can move two spaces down. No, I fucked it. No, I haven't. No, I haven't. No, I haven't. Right, here we go. So I need to get on that three spaces thing. One, two, down, and that's going to follow. Oh, this is so unresponsive at times. Right, okay, now I'm on the... F oh! F I'm going to say this, play the Commodore 64 version. It's a lot more responsive. Um, it's frustrating like the CPC version, but the Commodore 64 version just runs so much smoother. This one's more jumpy jerky and can be quite unresponsive. Um, yeah. I mean, it's alright, but play the Commodore 64 version. Anyway, 
I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time, and goodbye.